the Serengeti has some of East Africa's finest game areas. Besides being known for the Great Migration, the Serengeti is also famous for its abundance of large predators. The name Serengeti comes from the word Serengit in the Maasai language Ma, meaning endless plains. Follow us across the endless plains. Secretary birds spend a great deal of time on the ground, walking around on extremely long legs and searching for prey. They walk up to 30 kilometers a day. Nabe Hill Gate, the entrance to Serengeti. Mwanza flat-headed rock agama. This lizard reptile is also called the Spider-Man agama because of its coloration. Dominant males are the most colorful. It lives in semi-deserts and can often be seen in the heat of the day basking on rocks or kopjes. Unlike its brown and striped cousins, the spotted hyena is a predator, not a scavenger. Here we see him with a zebra leg. They will hunt their prey by sight, smell and hearing, unless they can drive another predator off its kill. Keeping an eye out for lions, leopards or even African wild dogs, who can steal his prey while eating. When standing like this, the plain zebras can rest their heads on each other's backs and watch both ways at the same time. Wildebeests have a better sense of hearing, while zebras can see very well. Finally, we see the African lion in a tree. Lions are believed to climb trees to protect themselves from the constant irritation of insect bites while lazing on the ground on the trees, or escaping the sweltering heat on ground level. The Gurumeti River is swollen with water. So much, we couldn't cross anymore. The topi is a large African antelope and a selective feeder. It uses its elongated muzzle and flexible lips to forage for the youngest blades of grass.
Topies use vantage points, such as termite mounts, to get a good look at their surroundings. Bare-faced go-away birds are named for their raucous go-away call. Why do zebras have black and white stripes? Scientists have put forward at least 18 reasons why. From camouflage or warning colors to more creative explanations like unique markers that help to identify individuals like a human fingerprint. Nowadays two possibilities remain protection from biting flies and thermoregulation. The flies would try to land on the stripes, but then fail to decelerate as they normally would approaching a non-striped surface and bounce off. Black hairs can trap heat in the cool morning and facilitate sweat evaporation at noon. The white stripes reflect light more and could thus help cool zebras as they graze for hours in the blazing sun. While driving through the bush, another car had a flat tire. African buffalo use mud baths to help regulate their body temperature and repel parasites and flies. The red-billed weaver 
feeds primarily on seeds of annual grasses. They occur in such enormous numbers that it often destroys grain crops and is sometimes called Africa's feathered locust. We had a tented chalet at Mambarlaghetti Serengeti. Mambarlaghetti is not fenced, so you will be picked up by a Maasai for dinner. Breakfast with a view over the plains of the Serengeti. Next week we will move on to the northern part of the Serengeti. If you like this video, subscribe to our channel and watch the next video. Dream, explore and, and travel, travel with us! us.